What is up everyone, Daryl Aronte is here and for today's video, we are going to go over Onisuka Tiger shoes, especially this Mexico 66 slip on shoes and why they are a must have shoes for a guy like you. This is like a review video, but at the same time, I'm going to briefly talk about why you should buy from this brand. Still sounds interesting. Let's get started. First off, Onisuka Tiger has a rich heritage and reputation when it comes to quality. The Japanese brand started in 1949, shortly after the war, which was originally a performance footwear company, but throughout many decades, they evolved to a more casual use. The brand was a go-to shoe for Olympic runners back in the 60s, and this is when the Mexico 66 was first introduced during the 1968 Mexico Olympic Games. They had a rise and fall throughout the decade, and personally, I got to know the brand, after I watched Kill Bill movie, Ulma Thurman was wearing the Mexico 66 in the film. All right, that's enough with the history lesson of Anisaka Tiger. Let's focus on why I love this Mexico 66 slip on so much, especially for the spring season. I've been wearing this many times already and you can see how much abuse I did with the shoes. First, let's talk about the style. Let's face it, sneakers can make or break an outfit. This Mexico 66 shoes are known for their timeless aesthetic and then this is one of the reasons why I love this shoe so much because I could literally pair this with anything and I'll be looking stylish except in a formal setting. The shoes are lightweight and according to its description they are made with 55% canvas and 45 synthetic leather. The leather parts are mostly under design where this yellow and red lights are and pretty much the rest are made with canvas. I love the outsole design, like they have this triangular things that look aesthetically pleasing. When it comes to comfortability, the slip-on shoes are great, even though the insoles do not have that much cushion. I didn't have to break them in when I first wore them, and what I love most about the shoes is that I could easily put them on and take them up. The price of each pair was about $100 plus, but I remember getting this on 50% sale, so I paid about $60. Definitely not bad for its quality and look. Well, just about as much as description that I could share with you guys. To conclude my thoughts on why I highly recommend these shoes, or generally speaking, the Nisica Tiger brand, it's simply because they have a wide range of styles available. From casual sneakers to retro-inspired trainers, like this Mexico 66, there's something for every guy's taste. Plus, Onisaka Tiger's connection to Japanese culture adds a cool factor to your wardrobe. Great everyday wear, whether you're just chilling or going out. Definitely affordable if you're getting quality uh, craftsmanship and style without breaking back. Now, here's the sad part. Um, Onisaka Tiger shut down their operation here in the US last year. Still, you still get those shoes on other websites like StockX, GOAT, and even eBay. Anyways, if you're looking for stylish, comfortable, and affordable sneaker with a bit of history, then the Mexico 66 slip-on shoes could be a great option. Well, folks, that's my quick review of the Nisica Tiger Mexico 66. Question, do you own a pair of the Nisica Tiger? If so, what's your favorite colorways or style? Comment below and let me know. And as always, stay stylish and stay amazing. You guys have a good day. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.